Before we get started in today's video, there are a couple vocabulary terms that are going to be very important for this skill. The first vocabulary term is terms. And terms are numbers, variables, or numbers and variables multiplied together. In the expression below, the terms would be 3x, 5, 6x, and negative 4. Notice how I kept that minus sign in front of the 4 with it to make it a negative 4. This is very important. The second vocabulary term is like terms. And like terms can have no variables, we call these constants. They can have the same variables, or they can have the same variable raised to the same power. In the expression below, the like terms would be 3x and 6x. Notice how both of those have the variable x, and then 5 and negative 4. Since neither of these terms have variables, these would be called constants. Adding linear expressions. There are three steps to add linear expressions. The first step is to remove the parentheses. The second step is to identify the like terms, and we can use shapes to do this. So the like terms in this expression would be 2x and 4x, because they both share the variable x, and then 9 and 1. Notice how I included the sign in front of the terms 9, 4x, and 1. I did this so I would know that these terms are all positive terms. The final step is to combine the like terms. We can see by the different shapes and colors which terms are the like terms. So first we will combine 2x and 4x, and 2x plus 4x is equal to 6x. Next we will combine positive 9 plus positive 1, and 9 plus 1 is equal to 10. Since both the 9 and the 1 were both positive, we know that we can put a plus sign in front of that 10 since it is a positive 10. Now we're left with the expression 6x plus 10. Since these terms are not like terms, they cannot be combined, which means we are done. The final expression would be 6x plus 10. Example number two. Step one, remove the parentheses. Step two, identify the like terms, use shapes. In this expression, the like terms would be 4x and positive 6x, and positive 2 and negative 7. This moves us on to step number 3. Combine like terms. The first pair of like terms is 4x and 6x, and 4x plus 6x is equal to 10x. The second pair of like terms is positive 2 and negative 7 and 2 minus 7 is equal to negative 5. Since we have a negative 5, we do not have to add the plus sign, because adding a negative number is the same as subtracting. For example, adding a negative 5 is the same as just subtracting 5. So for this one, I can turn that negative sign into a subtraction sign. So the final expression would be 10x minus 5. All right, now I have two problems I want you to try. Find the sum of each expression. I would recommend you pause the video now, solve, and resume when you're ready to see if your solutions are correct. All right, let's take a look. The final expression for number one is 10x plus eight. And the final expression for number two is 4y plus 5. If you had either of these incorrect, I would recommend you pause the video now, review your work, and see if you can find your mistake. Thank you for watching.